Be it the war on drugs or a war of actual conflict, we all know one thing for sure, and that war is hell. Well, luckily for our men and women abroad, there's been an angel on their shoulder when they don't have home field advantage. Since just before World War II, they're called the USO. They have been and continue to be the bridge between the American people and our men and women in uniform, conveying the heartfelt appreciation of a grateful nation. They've also had quite a few of America's most darling dames grace their stage over the years. And Samantha could never stop talking about the shows she'd seen in the past with the likes of Anne Margaret or Marilyn Monroe, or one very quirky, borshty beauty that comes to mind, a lovely ukulele player that she saw during the Korean War. And she had a huge crush on our Commander-in-Chief. Hello, boys! I'm Lucky Rose of Fallen. Oh, I, I see they let some girls into the, into the barracks. <laughs> You know how I can tell? Who else can nag without saying a word, right? <laughs> now, I know what you're really thinking. How is she staying up in those shoes? Ow, ow. Well, I'll tell you. Counterweight. <laughs> now, I'm going to get political here for a second. I know we're having a rollicking good time. We're enjoying some American classics from next door. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to I'm gonna take it down a notch. I'm gonna. I have some thoughts about our current president that I'd like to share with you. I'm gonna be in love with him. And I wrote a little song about it. <laughs>